They are so sweet. They survived COVID. Now they're marking a major milestone, a couple celebrating 69 years tonight. And they're finally getting to celebrate in person. That's after two years struggling went from heartbreaking to heartwarming. The video might make you smile or even shed a tear, but well beyond the heartbreak of being apart, 90-year-old Kenneth and 88-year-old Elizabeth Gage are madly in love. I just love her so much that I, uh, well, I don't want to get too sentimental. <laughs> we showed you in May 2020 when Kenneth surprised his bride with balloons and flowers at a woodland rehab facility. Because of COVID, there were no visitors. It would be the first time since they were teens the two were separated on their wedding anniversary. They w heard from the both of us how badly we wanted to be together. I don't care. If it's one hour, two hours, 10 days, 10 years, I just want to be with her. <laughs> you know? And now he can be. Exactly two years later and after surviving COVID, this time they're celebrating their 69th wedding anniversary together. They're way more in love now than even when I was growing up. I talked with one of their daughters, Darcy Findle, over Zoom from France for perhaps the best peek into just how much these two love each other. And they always celebrated their birthdays in black tie on their own. They didn't go to restaurants. They put on it. My dad wore a tux. My mom put on an evening gown and they had dinners my whole life. At home? Yep. Yep. They didn't have the money to go out for a steak dinner and they didn't really want to go out for a steak dinner. They wanted they to They just wanted it. to be together. Yeah. So what's the secret to their special bond? Kenneth says it isn't love, it's friendship, where it all started. Love is easy, but friendship is something that happens only once or twice to a person where it's, uh, it's something that, that just doesn't break. It doesn't sound like you just love them. It sounds like you admire your parents. I do. I do. They're inspirational. I just want young people to know that marriage takes some work and it's so rewarding. Uh, take some work and honesty, but boy, is it a war rewarding. So according to the gauges, the key to everlasting love, you heard it, friendship. Kenneth says Elizabeth first became his best friend when he met her when he was just 17. She was 15, and they've shared that love and friendship ever since. So sweet. We wish them the best.